now that you you know gotten somewhat of a week of practicing, how are you kind of fitting into just you know some of the things that they they want to do offensively running the football? Uh, I feel like I'm definitely I'm getting more in sync with the guys up front, and like I said last week, that comes with reps. So um, today, I mean this week was a a good week of preparation, and um, I feel a lot more confident. Open shape, but nothing like football shape. How, how have you kind of used practices to kind of help in that regard, and how's that coming along? Yeah, just treating every practice like it's a game. You know, uh, coming out, you know, that's pretty much going 100 miles per hour, and um, you know, but within the system and, and with what they're asking me to do as well. Um, you know, finishing runs 20, 30, 40 yards down the field um, to kind of get the cardio, get the legs used to rolling. Your of yourself after watching the film of the Rams game. Uh, well, I, I didn't have to watch the film. You know, I FaceTimed my son, and he was like, Dad, why were you running so high? <laughs> you know, that's one thing I always preached to him, so he was able to preach it to me, and I was like, you know what, you're right. You know, so that's one thing I took away from it. Um, you know, I ran extremely high. Um, um, another thing is um, just I think on a couple plays I, I was too fast and didn't let those guys – uh, up front, you know, work for me. Um, so those are things that um, some takeaways that I have from the game that I will improve on this week. How old is your son that said that? He's 10. Okay. Yeah. Is that something when you talk about, you go back to the film, you look at all that high? I mean, is that something that just you do naturally and then you can adjust it? Is it hard to adjust? Is it, mm -hmm. I mean, just from game to game, like how easy is something like that to fix? Uh, it'll be it'll be quite easy. Um, you know, I'm, I'm mad at myself because it wasn't something that I was conscious of um, during the game. Um, but when I think about it, you know, it was I didn't play ball in ten you know ten months. You know, so um, and then like I said, my son and my dad. There were so many people that were saying, "Hey, you were running high, man. You can get your shoulders slow." You know, so uh, I've been mindful. I've been going to sleep thinking about running my pad level low. So. Um, I'll be good. You know, I've been doing it for a long time, so that type of adjustment will be easy for me. You had mentioned, you know, giving the blocks and things time to settle up. That patience to the whole explosiveness through it, is that like the result of just being amped up and just excited about playing again? Yeah, yeah, being amped up, excited to play again. Um, but, you know, you got to remain centered in, in, in that moment. And, um, you know, some of those, some of those plays I, I, I wasn't, you know, so I'll make sure I, I eliminate that. Yeah, um, normally it's, it's, it's easy to pick up on, um, you know, with this system, it's, it's totally different, something that I haven't done in my, my entire career, um, but you got a great running back coach in Tony. And um, you know the guys in the running back room as well has been helping me since I since I arrived here, and I'm picking it up, you know, um, and I'm gonna do it the Titan way. Adrian, you guys won obviously despite <laughs> rushing just for 69 yards in the last week. Clearly, I, I'm assuming you don't think that's something that's sustainable. Can you just kind of speak to how you guys need to kind of get them gear moving forward? I'm sorry. Can you say that again, please? Sure. All of it. Yeah. You guys. You guys won despite just rushing for 69 yards. Last week, clearly, uh, I'm, I'm assuming that's something that you don't think is sustainable for success for this team. Like you guys, you know, yeah, yeah. I, you know, um, we definitely, you, know, you think about the Titans, you think about a, a strong running game, you know, and um, we know as a group we didn't perform well up to our standards. Um, you know, we take it personal, the offensive line take it personal as well. And, uh, you know, we're looking to improve that this, this, this Sunday for sure, without a doubt. I'm sorry, Mike Vrabel was, was saying one thing he noticed too, maybe with some of your cuts, uh, you know, he phrased it, you might like to have some of those cuts back. Was that sort of the same thing, you know, maybe just being a little bit too eager in that in that first game as well? Uh, Yeah, yeah, and he's absolutely right. It was a couple that I'm, I'm looking at on film, I'm like, man, I wish I could, you know, could, could have that one back, you know, but I've, I've said that over my, my entire career, you know, but, uh, you know, I, I feel like the biggest thing was just, Trusting those guys up front, you know, this is the first time in a long time I can say I have played with some guys up front that are they are actually really good, <laughs> you know. So um, just trusting those guys, letting those guys work, and um, you know, trusting the, our, our scheme and how we how the play is designed to 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 be run to be ran and and where it's designed to you know to hit it. 
Um, so just trusting that. And like I say, with reps, I've been able to get more comfortable, and I feel 10 times better than I did last week. How you fitting in as far as running back room, offensive lineman, just the team after being here a little bit more a week, maybe your comfort level there and, and what's around you? I feel like I'm fitting in well. You know, I'm getting more comfortable with the guys, more open, so becoming more more vocal. You know, I was just so locked in last, you know, last week. Um, but this week kinda of see myself kinda of laying loose a little bit and you know, being a little more talkative with the guys. Um, but we got a great a great uh, group of guys. Oh man, that's um, you know that's what you you look for. You know, best against the best. Uh, you know, playing against you know one of the best defenses in the in the league. And in my opinion, we're watching them. Um, so we're up for the challenge. I know the guys are excited um, offensively. So um, you know, we're just gonna put our best foot forward. At this point, what's that like as, as far as just kind of living on the fly like you've done and uh, kind of adjusting to a new city? Uh, it's really convenient, actually. You know, hotel is not too far from here. And, uh, you know, I like, I like my sleep. So, uh, you know, being five, seven minutes away is, is very convenient. But, you know, it is, it is what it is. Um, it'll be short term. And, you know, I'll be settled here in the next week or two.